in their main senses. We cannot understand what is Krishna or God, His name, His form, His attributes, His pastimes. We cannot understand by these blunt material senses. Then how it is to be understood? After all, this human life is meant for understanding God. That is the only business of human life. The nature, material nature, gives us this opportunity to have this human form of life, the facility of this life, or this form of life, is given to us just to understand God. Other forms of life, cats and dogs, trees, and so many other things, there are eight million four hundred thousand forms of life. So in other forms of life it is not possible to understand what is God. Uh, if we call all the dogs of the your country, uh, come here, we shall talk about God. No, no, there is no possibility of understanding. But in the human form of life, there is possibility. Doesn't matter whether it is in India or America or Australia, any human being. Uh, if he tries and if he uh, reads the scriptures, never mind Bible, Bhagavad Gita, Bhagavad, then he will understand God. The beginning of the Srimad Bhagavatam, Janmadasya Jata, absolute truth is that from whom everything has come into existence. Now, what is the nature of the Absolute Truth? Everything means there are two things, matter and spirit. Two things. Just like this table is matter, and we, living entities, we are spirit, spirit soul. This material body is my covering, just like dress. Every one of us is dressed, covered by some kind of dress. Similarly, all living beings, they are dressed by the material covering. The gross dress or coat and the subtle dress uh, the gauze dress is made of five material elements, earth, water, air, fire, ether, and the subtle dress is mind, intelligence, and ego. So we, the spirit soul, part and parcel of God, at the present moment we are covered by two kinds of dresses. The subtle dress mind, intelligence, and ego, and the gross covering, subtle means we know there is this thing, but we cannot see. Just like you know I have got mind, I know you have got mind, but I don't see your mind, you don't see my mind. I know you have got intelligence, you know I have got intelligence, but we don't say, don't see what is that intelligence. Simply uh, identification, I am this consciousness, that also you have got consciousness, I have got consciousness, but we don't see. So things which are not visible to these material eyes, that is called subtle. And spirit soul is still subtle. Uh, so uh, human life is meant for understanding that spirit soul and the supreme soul. Um, 
heard it too said that um, you aim to get beyond the disease of material existence. Um, I didn't quite pick up what your process was for doing this, um, but could you tell me what the end result is? Or why should you get beyond this? Um, mm -hmm. What is that? The in Krishna consciousness, the, the <coughs> process is to get beyond the disease of material existence. Yes. Yeah. The first part of his question, how to do this. The second part of his question, what is the end result after taking well, to the process? The, the process is to uh, mm, transfer yourself from material energy to spiritual energy. Uh, we are under energy. The God has got two energies, material energy and spiritual energy. We are also energy. We are marginal energy. So marginal energy means we can remain under the material energy or on the spiritual energy, as we make our choice. Marginal, just like on the beach, you find sometimes they, on the border of the water, the water is covering the land, and sometimes the land is open. This is called marginal position. Similarly, we are marginal energy of God, living entities. So we can remain under the water, means the material energy, or we can remain open on and spiritual energy. What is our uh, view of Lord Jesus Christ? In Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ, he is, he is Son of God, the best Son of God. We have all respect for him. Yes. Anyone who is teaching people about God consciousness, he is respectful to us. It does not matter in which country and which atmosphere you are preaching. It doesn't matter. Yes, sir. <coughs> so the practice of the sissi found God in the material rather than utilize the material for God. And some practice used to talk about brother dog and sister cat and sister water and brother wind. And um, what does his grace think of as some practice approached in the food? Yes. Saint Francis, uh, the founder of this particular order. Uh, which we have been invited to speak to, found God in the material world. And he used to address the aspects of the material world as brother and sister, brother tree, sister water, uh, like that. Uh, what is your view upon this? The real God consciousness. This is real God consciousness. Yes. Not that I am God conscious and I kill the animals. That is not God. To accept the trees, plants, lower animals, insignificant ants, even as brother, samasarvi subhuti. So this is explained in the Bhagavad Gita. Brahma bhuta prasanna atma na sochati na kankati samasarvi subhuti. So Sama, Sama means equal to all living entities, to see the spirit soul. So if St. Francis was thinking like that, there is higher standard of spiritual understanding. 